Well, carrying out wide areas of our viewing area, dealing with smoke from Canadian wildfires today. More details on air quality just ahead. May is mental, maternal mental health month, and we'll talk to a Sanford Health therapist to learn more coming up this morning. And other than that wildfire smoke, we're going to be dealing with some very nice weather here as we head through the rest of this week. Details are coming up in your first alert forecast. This is Dakota News Now, your first alert station. Well, good morning from all of us at Dakota News Now. It is just after 6 a.m. Thanks for joining us on this Monday morning. I'm Eric Thorstensen, Eldeka, away from the desk today. Well, you know, it was a, a pretty nice weekend, warm, a little bit of rain yesterday. It sounds like it's going to be okay today, with the exception of some of that uh, more Canadian wildfire smoke coming down, huh? Yeah, that's yeah. exactly right, Thor. We're going to be dealing with some of that smoke here across the region uh, today and then maybe again on Wednesday for some of us. And then if you're going a little farther to the east towards the uh, Twin Cities, they're going to be dealing with uh, a lot more of that wildfire smoke. We did have some rain earlier in northwestern Iowa that is exiting, though, and the clouds are starting to break a little bit as well. Temperatures are in the 40s and 50s to near 60 across parts of uh, southeastern South Dakota and northwestern Iowa. Wind, not too bad either, only about 5 to 10 miles per hour, and that's going to stay fairly light here today. Highs are going to be in the low to mid 70s with that wildfire smoke around, though. It's going to look a little on the hazy side out there. Thor, we're going to talk more about that smoke here as we come up in the next five minutes. And on a more on that, in addition to our first alert weather coverage, that Canadian wildfire smoke is drifting south. Now, our Ellen Scott, our Aberdeen Bureau reporter, provided the video you see on your screen here from yesterday showing it's already having an impact on uh, visibility in some areas. Now, air quality alerts will be in effect for a wide region of our Dakota News Now viewing area today. We will provide updates throughout the day. Now to some other headlines. One person is dead following a crash in Union County. It happened Saturday afternoon. The Department of Public Safety says a man was driving his motorcycle. We'll work our way up to 77 there on Friday and then drop down to the low 70s with plenty of sunshine coming up on Saturday, Thor. All right, let's take a look at that morning show, the answer to our morning show question of the day. So more than a third of adults do this every morning, and it is hit the snooze button. Hit that snooze button, yeah. A lot of people do that. It's a luxury we don't have. No, I don't, I don't get it away, but it gives you that extra like five minutes. To and then sometimes do it a couple times. People do. Sometimes you sleep in too late, too. Then yeah. you're in a rush. Don't do yeah. that. Yeah, Especially like, Monday morning. I, I got to get up right away. Same rush. here. Same All right. here. All right. Hey, well, thanks for joining us on this Monday morning. Have a great day. The morning news isn't done. We're back on the air at 9 with more local news. Join Bailey, L and First Alert meteorologist Aaron Doudna after GMA. Promotional consideration paid for by Avera Health, Carl's, and Touchstone Energy Cooperatives. Alerting you first, only on Dakota News Now. Good morning, America. Crucial day in Donald Trump's criminal trial. 